Hi everyone, uh, I am Madam Rosmaya. In this video, we are going to uh, find the radius uh, of a ball bearing okay, with uncertainty in measurement. Okay, remember, uh, recall to what we have learned before, there are two rules using differentiation in calculating the error. The first rule, uh, if the formula involves uh, addition or subtraction, example here, y equals to a plus minus b. Okay, so the error or the uncertainty, delta y is equals to the delta a plus delta b. So delta a is the uncertainty for a and delta b is the uncertainty for b. And the second rule, if the formula is uh, y equals to k, a to the power of m, b to the power of n per c to the power of r. So the error will be uh, delta y, okay, delta y per y equals to uh, m delta a per a plus n delta b per b plus r delta c per c. So we cross multiply y to the uh, right side so becomes uh, m delta a per a plus n delta b per b plus r delta c per c bracket times y okay let's say the diameter of a ball bearing okay measured using a micrometer screw get here we get 2.061 plus minus 0 0.001 okay bracket centimeter so we are going to find the uh, radius of the ball bearing so the formula is given by uh, r equals to d per 2. Okay, d is diameter, diameter per 2. So we substitute the 2.061 into the equation here. We get uh, radius equals to 1.0305 centimeter. Okay, now to determine the uh, uncertainty, okay, delta r. So we use a second rule. Okay, because this involves uh, division. Eh? So, delta R per R equals to delta D per D. So, 2 uh, is a uh, numerical value. So, no need eh, to write. So, only delta D per D. Okay, we cross multiply. We get delta D per D times R. Okay, then we substitute this R into here. So, D per 2. So, cancel the D. And we get uh, delta R equals to delta D per 2. Okay, so now we substitute uh, delta D 0 0.01 into the delta R here. So we get uh, 0 0.01 divided by 2, we get 0 0.0005 centimeter. Okay, next uh, we can write uh, the radius eh, uh, with uncertainty. So, we get uh, 1.0305 plus minus 0 0.005 centimeter. So, the error here or uncertainty here, we must write in one significant feature. And for both of them, must have same number of decimal place. So, 1.0305, we write in four decimal places. Okay, so this is the answer for radius. Eh? Uh, with uncertainty okay so that's all for the video and thank you for watching